Now, when you look at the number of, of refrigerators that we get rid of every single year, we get rid of hundreds of refrigerators a year. The partnership that we have with the electric company um, now to, to work on getting paid for these, because they will pay us $30, I guess, you know, to, to, to recycle these. And at the same time, use that money to go back into the units versus where we were, which is salvaging them and getting nothing more than, than what you would get for the just the weight of the refrigerators on a salvage sale. Uh, the benefits not only to the residents uh, of El Paso uh, who live in housing, uh, but also the community, the community themselves, uh, community members, that we don't have to worry about increasing our costs and the amount of electricity that we use. Uh, it's a great win, not only for El Paso, uh, for the housing authority, but also for the electric company and our partners. And so uh, with that, we think it's fantastic. Uh, we're very, very happy to, uh, to have this new partnership. Uh, and it's not just for us, just to let you know, if, I, if I'm right, I believe that anybody can also be participate as, as this program. And so as we talk about us recycling these refrigerators, people should think about themselves in their homes also calling the electric company to come pick up their refrigerators and also getting paid the $30 as they buy the, those new refrigerators that will save them, their own homes, electricity uh, dollars, but also create efficiencies within their, uh, within their own homes. And uh, I would just also like to recognize uh, Mr. Stroud, uh, Senator Rodriguez's office. Uh, unfortunately, the Senator was unable to be here based on what was happening last night until I believe 2 o'clock in the morning. Uh, and I just wanted to like to say a few words real quick on, on behalf of this program.